Only on CBS 13, a damn dilemma for the Folsom Spillway. The flaw now forcing a fix. But are these design problems impacting storm protection? Only on CBS 13, we're getting answers on the crisis, the cause, and the cure. In 2017, local dignitaries celebrated the construction of a new auxiliary spillway at Folsom Dam. And after years of drought, the flood control project was just used for the first time this January, allowing more water to be released from the lake as a series of strong winter storms hit Northern California. But now, CBS 13 has learned that parts of the nearly billion-dollar spillway are broken. This is a case where, with all the best intent, we applied a particular technology that wasn't the optimum. Bradley Call with the U.S. Army Corps of Engineers says the problem was with these 40 foot long metal rods that open and close these six steel gates. There are some cracks in the coating. So that's letting water get through those cracks. It's going to cause corrosion and could eventually not allow us to operate the auxiliary spillway. The damage stems from a design flaw within the original plans. It hadn't been done correctly during the construction phase of the project. And so we are going to make it right. It'll now take more than $16 million to replace the 12 defective rods, which are set to be installed beginning in 2025. Our goal is to keep the auxiliary spillway in service as much as possible because it could be needed at short notice. So what impact will this have on flood control along the American River? We're not expecting that this would cause any problem, and we would only do one gate at a time, so there'd still be the remaining five gates to be used if that was necessary. And he says lake levels will not have to be lowered during the repairs. We want to get this done properly, resolve all remaining construction deficiencies. Now the Army Corps says the repair work will take place during summer and fall when the spillway would typically not be needed, but all the rods won't be fixed, we're told, until the year 2027.